Hey guys, always your dad here, and today I'm bringing you a video on the recent HC build contest. Uh, I wanted to take screenshots with shaders, but I could not get it to work without my screen flickering. So I just decided to do this video. I may switch over to like an enhanced um, resource pack. Um, it looks okay. Mixing is more colorful. The one I'm using now is Von Von Doomcraft. It's a bit of an outdated version, but I like it the best. So, okay, we're gonna get right into it. So, we're gonna just gonna go to the one that's first tier. Alright, this one is by Chaco Kawai. I hope I said that name right. So, we're just gonna do a quick flyover and just look at each, each of the plots. I may add some uh, comments here and there. Nice castle here. I think it could use a little bit more detail on the outside. But overall, it looks pretty decent. Uh, and at the end, I will um, say who I chose, you know, first, second, and third. So, yeah, this plot looks pretty good. Um, I have to say, my main, the main flaw would probably be a little bit more detail in this castle, and I think it would bring it up a few more notches. All right, let's go on to the next one. All right, this one is by um, Commander GB7, but I think he changed his name, so uh, I'm not too sure what's going on here uh, with this farm. I'm not sure if he had time to finish. He got in kind of late. I extended the contest two days. Um, uh, it really doesn't look like he finished, but. I mean, <laughs> this house looks good, but that's about it. I think he needed more time, quite honestly. Decent, but needed more time. We're going to move on here. We're going to go to day, because I hate night. This one's by Ender Badger 96 Let's do a quick flyover. Nice windmill over there. Some pretty nice houses. Graveyard, little pond, and um, she said she had some Easter eggs she wanted me to find. She said there was eight of them, so we're going to try to find some. Hopefully it doesn't take too long, because I don't want this video to be that long. Okay, so there's five. I've already found a couple when I was doing a flyover um, beforehand, but I haven't. I didn't find all of them. I probably found like three. I'm going to get trapped in here. So five was back there. Uh, I don't think anyone's gonna be up here. Wait, what's up? Oh, Lima Bean Lake. It's just the name of the lake. I'm probably missing a ton by flying. What's that? Oh, there's the third egg, number three. Mm hmm. Pretty nice wheat fields here. I like this windmill. Um, let's see. Uh, I am probably missing a lot of them. That's okay though. Dun, dun, dun. I hope I don't uproot these. Dun, dun. Where are they? I'm not finding any. I've only found two. Oh. There's number six. So I think we found number three, number five, and number six. I think there was one over in this area. Oh, that was number two. So I think we found number two, number five, number six. What was the other one? I think it was like four or something. Da -da. Nice TNT over here. I don't think there's anything over here. I think this is an abandoned mine. There might be something down here. Uh, nothing that I see. Nothing down here. Let's go 
go quick this way. Go, go, go. I think I was already over in this area. Oh, man. Oh, did I already get that one? Yeah, I already got that one. I wonder if there's one in each house. That means there's got to be one on the windmill. Wait, what was that over there? I think I already got that one. Number three. Yeah, I think we got that one already. Oh. Number four. Okay, so we've got three, four, five, six. Three, four, five, six. That's four of them. That's half. But wait, we've got two also, so that's five. I wonder if there's some in here. Nothing in there. Oh boy. Alright, Ender, I think this is gonna beat me here. If I continue looking, the video is just gonna drag. Alright, I'm waving the white flag here. Ender, you win. So this is her plot. It looks pretty good. Um, I kind of wish there was maybe more houses as compared to trees, but it looks pretty good. Uh, moving on. We're going to go to Enderman Ends. Alrighty, do a quick flyover. Nice little pond, some nice houses. Again, a windmill. Looks like a, possibly a church there. Church tower. A little maze. Kind of like a maze garden. Looks like a tower here. You know, again, you know, details key. Maybe, um, like, I think it's just lacking a bit of depth, maybe on the sides. But overall, I think it, this uh, looks decent. We're, we'll take a quick look inside. Oh, actually, you know what? I think I remember her saying this was a uh, barn, not a castle. Um, I didn't uh, require them to do anything, like, any work on the insides. But, you know, that was totally up to them. I do kind of wish there was some uh, diversity with these buildings. I mean, they're not all the same, but like this row. Nah, I think that row's all the same. And nice graveyard there. You know, it looks decent. Looks pretty good. And we're going to go ahead and move on here to... John Coos, hopefully I'm saying his name right. Apologies if I'm not. So he made a um, a ship, a pretty good ship, and uh, it looks like it's being uh, attacked by like a sea monster, like an octopus, or pretty well detailed. Very nice, very nice. I don't think there's anything below deck, but we'll go take a look. So nothing over here. I think there was another entrance point at the other side. So we'll go over there. Right here. These must be the uh, cannons. You can see the uh, octopus or sea monster or whatever it is is obviously destroying the ship. So yeah, it's looking pretty good. A lot of cannons. Pretty well detailed if I must say, my, say so myself. So, we'll do one last flyover on this and uh, then we'll move on. Looking pretty good. Good job so far. Now the next one is Callista is my name. Do a quick flyover. Uh, 
All right, and we're back. Uh, I didn't realize I can only record 10 minutes at a time. So we're back on Callista's My Name's Plot, and she's built in a style that is a uh, Japanese kind of style. Uh, it could be wrong. Uh, that's what it looks like to me. And it looks pretty good. Um, uh, I like it. I like it a lot, honestly. Just the style. It looks really nice. We're going to go ahead and take a quick, quick peek inside. Everything looks pretty good. And I think there's an upstairs as well. Nice bed. We're going to go back out and do a final flyover. Forgot I had speed ton on. That's okay. Again, looking pretty good. Nice fountain right there in the center. Alright, now um, what I think I'm going to do is uh, do another flyover of all the plots, just really quick. Um, in a different resource pack, so we're going to go to spawn first, and then we're going to switch this out. Then I'm going to throw on essence. It's going to really make things pop. So, wait for that to load up. It's going to take a second. And there we go. So we're going to go ahead, and I think hers is right here, right? Alrighty. So just a quick flyover. I'm not going to do many comments. Looks pretty good. Alright, next one. Commander GD7. Alrighty. Again, I think he changed his name. That's why the Exocrits is coming up. Alright. Ah. All sorts of fails. Looking pretty good. That water really pops in this uh, this resource pack. Makes it look really well. Or not really well. Really good. That's a better word. I can't speak today. It's alright though. Alrighty, next one. Nice quick flyover. We're going day, but nobody likes night. I meant to say that the other way around, but we're going to keep going because we don't stop here. Alrighty, next one. Alrighty. This ship actually looks completely different in this resource pack. Still looks good nonetheless, but I think I like it better in uh, the Von Doomcraft. Alrighty, next one. Lista is my name. Hopefully I can get this in the first try, and I did. Very nice. Nice quick flyover. This plot looks pretty sharp in this resource pack. That center really pops. The water is nice and blue. I'm going to be saying that a lot, so. And we're going to go ahead and just move on here to Lost, and just going to call him Lost. And I intended to move the warp. I, uh, you know, just forgot. Looking good. The buildings look a little different in this resource pack. Nonetheless, they look good. Nice little graveyard there. We're going to go ahead and move on to Plotney 5000. Again, nice quick flyover. Buildings looking decent in this pack. Nice blue water. Let's go ahead and move on. Crash rate. Oops. Where is he? There he is. Looking really nice in this one. Alrighty. Didn't know the fire did that, but yeah. Alright, so we're going to go ahead and switch back to... Um, the Von Doom craft, and then I'm going to decide who will be first, second, third. Uh, I've actually already pre-decided, so it's just the fact of saying their names. And I'm going to go first, second, then third. Alright, so first is going to be... God dang it. 
Alright. So first is Callista is my name. Um the build isn't very big, but it's pretty detailed and it it just looks really nice overall. Alright, and we're gonna go ahead and move on to second. And second is John Coos. Again, if I'm not saying his name right, then I'm sorry. A really nice ship he's got here. It looks really nice. Very nice indeed. Alright, we're going to move on to number three. To Lost. The main things that really caught my eye at his plot was um, his clock tower here, and um, his houses. They look they look pretty good, pretty pretty good. I think um, it would have brought it up more if it was like maybe more of them, more like a town. I guess. I mean, I guess you could say this is a town, but nonetheless. It looks good. Uh, all the plots looked pretty good. It was really hard to kind of, you know, decide between all of them. Uh, you know, it was a pretty hard decision. But first is Quiz is my name. Second is John Coos. And third is Lost. First prize is $100 store credit. Second prize is $50 store credit, and third prize is $25 store credit. Hey guys, before I end this video, I just want to say thank you to anyone who signed up for the contest and everyone who participated in the contest. Um, and also, those who want to participate in the future, um, if you want to participate, then sign up. Uh, there's nothing saying that you can't, and if people say that you won't win, uh, just don't listen to them and sign up anyway, because you never know. Uh, yeah, so again, thank you guys for participating, and I will definitely be looking forward to hosting more of these. Uh, I don't know about doing them, like, every month. I might do them every two months, just because I, I think if you did them every month, they would get stale quick, and it would just get boring. Um, also, this contest didn't really have a theme. Uh, going into it, I was thinking about doing a theme, but then I thought it would just make it really restricted as to what people could do. So I just decided not to. Um, so once the next contest rolls around, there will definitely be another announcement. So we hope to see you guys there.